How's it going, everybody? Hope you're having a good start to your weekend. It is Friday. I know I'm going to have a good weekend. It's just been snowing for the last couple days. And Monday, as usual, is snowboard day. So it's supposed to snow all weekend as well. I can't wait. Should be a good time. But right now, we are going to be playing some Star Citizen and killing some time, making some money, earning some rep, and waiting for 318.1. Because why not? This game is so busted, it needs anything it can get right now. Um, and then, supposedly, in May, we are supposed to be getting 319, which is going to bring some pretty nice features, hopefully. We will see. Um, going to be adding some uh, tractor beam additions so you can actually swap parts and components on your ship manually and you will not need to be at a space station you can be carrying the part and swap it in yourself which will also allow you to be able to steal parts and sell them so hey one more point to piracy other than that we are already in the game i am currently eva and floating through space trying to get to a landing pad so i can get back into a space station and call a ship so Let's move over to there and you can join me in my boredom as I slowly float through space. And here we are. We're also joined by Cat. He's currently playing. He's out salvaging right now. He's somewhere over there. No, that's my freelancer. There he is out there. As soon as I can get back in, I am going to be grabbing my vulture and I'm going to be joining him as well. But I am currently trying to work my way back into the space station. In order to do that, I have to make my way back out to the pads over here. And uh, we're not going to discuss why I'm doing what I'm doing here. But I, uh, well, I guess we can. Brought out the freelancer Max as much as I hate that damn thing. And, uh,. We're going to be moving cargo, or should I say salvage cargo, over from the vulture to the freelancer. That way we can carry more. Because more is better, right? But last night, I basically put two loads in the freelancer from, from the vulture. There's a couple extra boxes than you can normally carry because... You don't have to worry about them not being snapped into the grid. And uh, so I was able to make a little bit more than standard. Just in two loads. So I figured maybe we can try it again tonight and uh, get as much in there as we can and go from there. So I guess I gotta work my way back to a landing pad so I can get back inside. I mean, I guess I could have just backspaced. But what's the fun in that? At this point, we're almost there. Last night when I was trying this, I uh, filled the vulture, EVA'd out of the vulture, got the freelancer, and it became a mess. Because every time I tried to get near the vulture with the freelancer, the boosters or like the maneuvering jets would push the vulture all over the place. Made it a nightmare trying to chase it down. So we're trying things a little differently tonight. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I clipped right through that. Nice. Figured tonight we could try uh, putting the freelancer out and then going to get the vulture because the vulture can't push the freelancer around. Now the music is not loud enough. At least I know I couldn't hear it. Woo. Hey, hey, hey. Hello over there. 
Garrett's trying to grab. That is not working properly. Should be like locking onto the space station and allowing to pull me forward. And it is not doing that. Like trying to hit behind me. Oh, here's our pad anyway, so. Why is the music paused? That would explain why I couldn't hear it. Or was it not even playing during the intro? <laughs> nice. Love it when I do stuff like that. So how many panels you got over there? Uh, I think there's like three or four more besides the two that I've done already. Be close to full then. Yeah, I'm pretty close. I'm like two or three boxes away from full. Come on, snap to something. Wish I had more distance. Trying to lock on over there. Successful. Even though I shouldn't have to wait for it, should be ready to go. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Come on, you can do it. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Hey, you're one, huh? again. Goodbye. Kind of hoping GT would jump in, but. Yeah, where's he been, man? Family and all the fun stuff, I guess. Yeah, no man's sky. <laughs> it's like his one true love, man. Eh, not really. He's learning to hate it more and more. <laughs> I could deal with the game until they did a few updates back when they changed the whole building mechanics. It drove me insane.
Nah, I'm still in the same spot. not where we were last night, then. I was 20 meters away from you, like, five minutes ago. I know, now it's showing you, like, 43 million kilometers away. Nah, I'm still in the same system as you. I'm probably just in line with you and, like, Mike L1 or something like that. I don't have quantum on and still showing you it's 43 million miles away. <laughs> I mean, I believe you. But... Yeah, you are 9,000 meters away from me right now. I mean, here's a Drake Vulture, which I'm assuming is you. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're 9,000 meters away from me right now. Not very far at all. Yeah, for whatever reason, I'm gonna say your icon thinks you're in uh, micro tech. All right, four more boxes, and I'm full. Then I'm off to sell, and then we can fucking dogfight or something. I don't know. Well, actually, I'm going to go sell, and then I'm going to run and grab dinner, and then we can dogfight. Hey, hey, hey. Thrust is not turned up that high. Thanks for ruining a good time by telling me this is a copy of Power Watch Simulator. <laughs> I mean, it's not really ruining a good time because at least this you're getting a good reward. And 190k no, just, is pretty just, fucking good. I'm just kidding. Well, like I said, that was two loads in the back of the Freelancer. I wouldn't mind getting a couple more than that, but. Yeah, no, that's like a whole fucking Saturday afternoon thing or Sunday afternoon thing one of these days when I'm off. Yeah, we'll, we'll get a freelancer like, out here and fucking... It looks like you can fit about seven uh, vulture loads in the back of it or close to it. Yeah, one of us will grab a freelancer and the other one can fucking grab a vulture and then go and then we'll grab the other vulture and we'll just well, start that's what I was hoping GT would pop up. And GT can hang out and fly the fly the freelancer, and we can just keep filling it. 
Yeah, that'd be great. And then we split the money three ways. Fuck yeah. Strip this one. I'm gonna say you already stripped this one for, for whatever reason. It's still showing is blue. Literally. Uh, no, I think somebody else was out here stripping these too, because the one that I did, that I started with, wasn't a complete panel. Only half of it was uh, salvageable. And it was fucking green when I went up to it, like, 100%, and then I only got, like, half of it. Yeah, well, I won't show green unless it's 100%. Well, I know, that's what I'm saying, is that it showed green, but I only was able to do half the panel. Now, most of these oh, are two-sided. No, they're only one-sided. Oh, I thought they were two-sided. Some of them like have like a curve on them, you know what I mean, and they go like around. But they're most of the panels are a single-sided panel. Like the one you're working right now has like two sides, but it's only because it like rolls around, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one I just hit. Yeah. First one I hit over here. Yep. Alright, well, these have all been scavenged. Really? All four of them? The other ones are just little strips. Ah, shitty. two boxes shy of uh, of full so I might just go sell and then run to uh, uh, here's some more right things. here it looks like alright I'll come start a panel and get these last two let boxes me see if, let me see if that's what it is it's, it's registering as 5100 so Basically, what you just got. 
you know, like maybe like four panels. Much as it's not going fast, this thing doesn't break very easily. Either. <laughs> Full blast. Nope. I'm not full blast. They're rocks. Can't make out what that said. Nothing. Yeah, weird. You're coming up as two icons right now. Yeah, that's weird as shit. but my numbers aren't showing up anymore. Oh, there we go. Signature 1700. Oh, I just had one hit 14,000. Yeah, that's the one you're looking for. That'll be like six panels. Six or seven panels. Where the fuck did it go? I think it was this one. Because now it's not, now it says 5100. Yeah, I got a few panels over here. A couple of them. I think, nope. Fuck. Three rocks together. <laughs> Twelve thousand. Fourteen. Yeah, it's staying at fourteen thousand. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Don't be a bunch of rocks. Oh, this should be... Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is definitely the, uh... The spot. Yeah, you definitely want to pop out to me. something else if we were going to do this. Um, I don't know if you want to do this. Um, I was going to pick up a box mission and then bring the box here or like, you know, like use the box as a marker. Oh, that's smart. Then you just untrack and track the box mission. You know what I mean? Like when you're wanting to find it, come back to a spot like this. I was actually going to quit after this, but I just wanted one load. There's like three or four here without a problem. These all seem to be full-size panels. I just need like one and a half boxes of material and then I can go sell. And then I thought we were going to dog fight after that. AGT. No, like I said, we can dog fight any time. I was just saying... You ever want to practice dog fighting? Like it's we, something we can do. You just don't press charges. What are you doing, GT? What's up? What's up, GT? Where the fuck you at? Come fly our freelancer for us. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Very nice. Want to make some money, GT? I gotta go grab some dinner before it gets too dark out. Whoa. That almost pissed me off. Well, why don't you, like, come and fry, fly one of the ships that I have out? And then you can just sit there and smoke while we, like... Yeah, I was thinking we could do some dog fighting after after you fill yeah, up, you I guess. Because I'm going to run and grab dinner. And that should give you enough time to fill up. Because I still got to fly over and sell it, then go grab dinner, come back, eat. And then we can uh, do some dog fighting. someone to fly one of the other ships I have out. 
That way I can keep doing this and then transfer the cargo from this on to that one. Pretty much where we left off last night. We miss some material now. smashing into the piece yeah because i'm full so i'll uh i'll go sell and then i'll uh backspace to avarice and then uh go get dinner eat it and then i can grab like my cutty we'll go we'll go cutties first about the bitches jam. We will find out. Should have filled another box by now. Okay. 
because all the seat kicks you right out into the door. Come on. Interesting stuff, this lag. For a minute, I didn't think it snapped in it. See that mess? <laughs> that was interesting. Anytime you want to come on, lasers. Actually, I'm not going to back space. I'm going to claim a ship at our port. Ooh, you want to do a Pisces fight? <laughs> sure. You should never fight in a Pisces. Run away. Yeah, I'll get my uh, Cuddy Black and my Gladius claimed while I'm running to grab food. What is that symbol in the top right corner with a target on it? Huh? I have a symbol in the top right corner of my screen with a target on it. Uh, that means you're wanted? How many bars are lit up on around it? One? One. I have a crime stat one. Why do I have a crime stat one? Uh, you bump into somebody else's ship or bump into the space station? Trespassing. Fucking trespassing earlier. <laughs> yeah, you can pay it off. It won't keep you from being able to land at a space station or anything. And now you can go up to Crime Stat 2 before uh, it starts to give you trouble. Like, uh, Crime Stat 3 and above is when it'll start shooting at you now at a space station. So if you have Crime Stat 2 or lower, you can go and just pay it off. What did you fly near that you got trespassing? I wanted the low fly over our court. Area 18. Oh. <laughs> and it didn't warn me at all that I was trespassing until it the, the timer was at zero. Like, it didn't yeah. pop up and say that I... Yeah, and then all of a sudden I was like... It said, trespassing, and then popped me back to the spaceport. Right, and impounded your ship. Yep, and I was like, motherfucker. Yeah, it was server lag. Um, yeah, it did that to me the other day. Well, it was a while back at this point. Um, so there are certain areas of Arcorp you can fly around through, and it won't do that. Like, um, if you go from Area 18, I think, and you fly towards where it says Skyscraper... I want to say you can fly through that section over by Skyscraper and all that. I just wanted to follow the route of the train. Oh, yeah, you can't even go near that train. It totally wigs out. I didn't want to go near it. I just wanted to fucking fly the same route. 
Yeah, well, it's not easy to fly while you're looking straight up. Oh, because all the... Yeah, I get it. <laughs> it took me a minute there. Yeah. I think they're broken everywhere. I really need to get a new keyboard. I've only had this one for... God. I don't even remember. <laughs> no, I wanted to go down, you silly bastard. Go down. Keyboard's got to be at least 20 years old. 15 at best. I mean, like... Uh, maybe this one's 15. Wow. Good lag going on. All right, I'm actually going to run and grab food now before I fall asleep. Yep. God, this server's got some hard lag. Oh, I never turned off the ship. The... heads like twice salvaging heads I don't know what to call these right now fill my ship. dogfighting night, but sure. Give it a shot. At least staring at this is not doing my eyes any good. Around. Oh, more on the other 
percent. Beans a little bit. in the red That's a lot of material though So tasty. You don't like seeing that bounce around in your ship. Magic teleporting box. Oh, damn. Might have to warm myself up some more of my own dinner.
moving around. Crap. Well, I can't remember how much more space I have. Plenty of space. time. Ugh. I'm like good old fashioned lag. Jeez. It's gonna blow up my ship, I know it. Just trying to place these damn boxes. Ah! Ugh, God, that scares me every time. I'm waiting for my guy to either be killed or go through the ship. Either one of them would be a good experience. Probably the whole fucking wrong order you last night, basically. 
I got a burger. It was the wrong burger. I didn't receive the bacon that I ordered on the side for the dogs. Gave me a regular Dr. Pepper instead of a diet Dr. Pepper. fly over to Everest and get my fucking gladius and stuff because it's over there so we need to be over there somewhere. I want to make money. Struggling to claim ships over here at our corp. What the dog do? There's the GT. What's going on? What's up dude? My bad, dude. I was munching out real quick. I did shit all day. You're good, dude. It wasn't even the healthiest thing, bro. I just threw some like quick French fries in the air fryer and just catch up on that shit. <laughs> when, when is it ever the healthiest thing? No, you got a point though. <laughs> I always eat crap. You preaching to the choir here, buddy. And the crap can actually kill him. What do you mean? <laughs> Listen, just as much as it can kill you, I just have to take my insulin <laughs> from a needle, okay? <laughs> oh, you get your insulin from your pancreas, I get mine from a needle. Yeah, if you're anything like my roommate, man, fucking Rex, it's a fucking pain in the ass. You remember? I don't think you ever met Rex, did you? No, I never met Rex, but you told me about him. Goddamn motherfucker. Come home, fucking... Before he can even say hi, mo start fucking convulsing and shit, drop on the floor. It's like, God damn it, you haven't eaten all day, have you, you fucker? Oh, Jesus. I have had times where I've forgotten to eat. I'll, I'll, I'll fully admit that. They gotta, like, run around and, like, find fucking orange juice or a candy bar for him to fucking eat as soon as he comes out of it. That shit can cause seizures, dude. That's crazy. Oh, yeah. Low blood sugar and high blood sugar light can cause seizures. I, I don't see it. That could be dangerous, though, man. Like, what if you're, like, driving and that shit goes down? Bro, you're fucked. He's had it happen. <laughs> I... I've You're also fun. had it happen. Jesus. You just pull over as best as you can. My roommate got in an accident. Fucks his shit all up. If you're lucid say, enough. If yeah. you're lucid enough, you pull it over. If not, you fucking have a seizure on the road and hope you don't die. I've seen a or couple kill of anybody else. seizures, bro. And it's like, I don't think you can operate anything <laughs> when you're going through something like that. Fuck. I need to be better, bro. <laughs> Fuck. Well, I guess I'm giving up my grand plans of being a millionaire. Not working out for you, but... No. Cat wants a dog fight. God, getting in and out of the sea of this uh, vulture right now is carrying the living piss out of me. Alright, I'm just gonna fly straight to Hurston. Then I'll just sell my junk at Hurston and then I'll have to uh, uh, call a ship at Everest. Oh, no, 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 I'm not doing that. I'm going to be flying to Area 18, <laughs> selling this, and then I'll meet you at Everest, I guess, or wherever you are, Argyle 1. I'll be waking up at Everest in like half an hour. <laughs>
God, I can't wait till this rain is fucking done and the dogs don't come back in covered in mud every fucking time. Rain, huh? You know, I'd, I tell you, I'd, I'd rather have rain than fucking wind, dude. It's been windy the last two fucking days, and it's just, it's miserable. Really? Yeah, and, and before that, dude, it was nice and sunny, you know, warm, and felt like spring, you know? And just the last two days have just been fucking ass. Hmm. Oh, one fucking dirt everywhere. Oh. Yeah, I guess that's pretty bad when you're in Texas and there's dust and shit. That's all there is here, bro. You <laughs> live in a fucking sandbox. I was like, yeah, wind's really not that bad up here. Like, it kind of sucks, but it, it's Texas not as like... Texas fucking drops to 32 degrees, the world shuts down. Yeah, pretty much. Forget if it does rain, dude. But people don't know how to drive in this shit, bro. That's stupid. Exit, it's left and right, bro. Finally, I got it. Don't worry. Uh, That's pretty much everywhere. They have people here that think just because they're in an SUV, they can go hauling ass down the interstate when it's snowing. Yeah. There is an accident here. where you guys are at. Say that there's like an accident, right? Traffic's backed the fuck up. Do people just start going over the median and like taking their own exit? No, not here. They do that shit here, bro. <laughs> you know, it you'll, gets you'll, dangerous. You'll, you'll, you'll get shot for that here. You get shot. <laughs> oh fuck! Who's the party leader, real quick? Oh, I am here. I'll get you an invite. Oh, I need to click on somebody so I can come. In. That's why I was asking. Oh, not bad. You're a cat, right? It doesn't matter which one you click on. Yeah, we're both in the same server. Oh, okay, cool. Right. I'm coming in, bro. That, that is not for you to sit on, really. Oh, my God, never mind. I'm not even going to try. You can always tell when your lights are on in Pisces. Oh, what, you get a medical one? Yeah. God damn, the direction I came in from Everest Harbor is right, like the sun is right behind Everest. Ah, I can't even fucking see the goddamn station. <laughs> um, so do a quick search for Star Citizen Reshade. And look for the newest video that posted. If you need me to, I can look for it. Takes the brightness of the sun down. Oh, way more than that. Problem is, depending on what games you play, some games see reshade as a cheat. Star Citizen allows you to use it. Like, there's even an option to, like, toggle it on and off in Star Citizen. Basically allows you to replace all the shaders in the game. Like textures and stuff? No, just the shaders. Okay, shading, okay. The, when it was updating the other day, it, I was kind of like reading as it was updating um, the log, I guess they put there uh -huh. uh, on the launcher. And it was saying something about if you're having some kind of issues to go into the files and like delete the shaders or something. Yeah, you can do that so every that, time. Yeah. Then, depending Is on it how. Yeah, like, do it, you, you usually. I haven't done anything like that, bro. Yeah, I mean, just most people click and don't. Play. Yeah. Most, people don't. most of the updates aren't that aggressive that it's an issue. 
guy should be fine. Um, right? But like, if you're going from like 314 to 315, you probably want to delete your shader. You know what I mean? Like, because they're probably making massive changes in something. Um, but most updates, it's wise to delete them. 90% of the people don't. Yeah, you you might run into some issues, GT. Just a heads up, it is big, like yes, like sir. we know we know we know Star Citizen fucks up sometimes, right? Like like there's there's shit that happens. It yeah. is extra bad right now. <laughs> cool. Like some people can't pull ships out of hangars. Some people get, can't even get into the no, fucking he was, game. He was playing the other night. He didn't have any problems. Well, the last oh, two okay. times that I've played so far, I, it, the train takes forever to load in. But it, it's so it that's like something that can be solved with possibly changing, like deleting your shaders. So, but I noticed I had it the other day. It's the two trains are with almost synchronized on top of each other. And so what happens is the one says it's going to be there and it does show up. You just don't see it. And then if you watch and pay attention, like I've watched it go and like appear as it's leaving the station. Um, and, oh, then, <laughs> and then just as it's, as it's leaving the station, the other train comes shooting in. Yeah, it's, <laughs> fucking it's, game, dude. Yeah, it's all fucking jacked up. <laughs> That's great. That's some shit you expect from No Man's Sky, bro. Come on. But yeah, Area 18, Area 18 right now is my uh, default like spawn are you point. Still, are you still having that issue? You can't oh, change yeah. it to Everest? Not that I can't change it to Everest. <clears throat> I can't reclaim a ship at Everest. Like, I almost always place Lorville as my main spawn, you know? And when everyone was having issues, I reset my character or repaired my character, but it reset my character. And when I reset my character and like told it where I wanted to spawn, I accidentally told it area 18. And now, yeah, Loreville and 18 are like glued together. Anything I try to do at Loreville, it affects everything at 18 and puts everything at 18. Good job. Yep. All right, where do you want to meet over by Everest? I still got to sell my shit. Hold on. All right, I'm just wondering where you want to meet. I, right by Argo 1 is fine. It's not that far. <laughs> All right, so you want to meet over at our court. Isn't that where you already were? No, I'm at Everest. Oh, I can meet you there. I just gotta sell this shit at Area 18 really quick. I meet you wherever. I got my I got my cutty. I can jump to wherever. How much is the cutlass? Uh, 1.4 million in game and like 110 cash. It's not bad. So if you have like, what do you have? You have a Mustang, right? No, I have the MR Aurora. It's like a shuttle. He knows what it is. Yeah, you could probably upgrade to the Cutlass pretty cheap. Hey, I don't remember how much. The... His package is forty-five dollars. The so it costs Cutlass, like 60 bucks. depending on whether it's on sale or not, it's like hundred and twenty bucks. like that shit man. that cutlass is nice yeah they oh, removed the yeah. cutlass awesome like 60, 65 <laughs> shit my bad dude i went to go hit my cigarette and i fucking choked <laughs> jesus yeah, i need to change my fucking oil mm -hmm. that shit went like down the wrong tube or something man that shit burned <clears throat> What are you like fucking 13 smoking your first pack bud i know right <laughs> i remember my first camel <laughs> i forgot how to hit this motherfucker, bro. 
Look, guys, I'm cool. You trying to snort a fucking hit through your nose or some shit? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, I remember doing that bullshit. Oh. All right, food's here. I gotta get out of this hangar and then I'm gonna go grab that. Get your tacos, bro. That's yeah, not tacos, unfortunately. It's, oh. it's a baconator. Ooh, even better. Got a jack in the box for breakfast this morning. Shit was bomb. Uh, yeah, I don't know if it's like an organ thing or something, but the Jack in the Box is up here pretty shitty most of the time. No, they're pretty shitty everywhere. It's just you have to be yeah. in this shitty food. <laughs> jack in the Box is like the greasiest fucking crap you could possibly stuff in your gullet. I do like that they have all-day breakfast, though, and their breakfast is almost as good as McDonald's. I would, I would agree with that. Yeah. But at least they have burritos and McDonald's does it. Like you want a sloppy, yeah, crispy McDonald's taco? Does. Jack in the Box makes a nasty, fucking crispy taco. They're just the, McDonald's does make burritos. They're just not like fucking Jack oh, in the God, Box no. breakfast burritos. God, they suck. Or they tequila. You want a decent breakfast burrito from a crappy fast food place? Go to the uh, art or. Uh, uh, Oh, Christ. Carl Jr. and whatever the other one is, Hardee's. Taco Bell's also got Taco really Bell. good breakfast burritos. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. They got that crunch wrap thing, that breakfast crunch wrap. God, oh. really? We're having conversations about crappy ass fucking food. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah. Fuck How do we yeah. do this? Almost every <laughs> fucking time we start talking about this garbage. About food, bro. It's just, you know, it's it's something you, you go through every day in life, bro. <laughs> On. We're we want to talk about work. clothes. We can talk about some clothes. <laughs> I've had this fucking hoodie for like ten years, dude, and it's like, it's like Adam's thick, right? I, and I don't want to get rid of it, man. But it's 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 Is falling it apart. Or what, I'm man? To God, that I can find another one that's similar to it. Because I don't like wearing heavy jackets. Um, but yeah, dude, I'm kind of sad, bro, because like the zipper's all fucked up now. <laughs> I've seen that ATF forever. emblem. Uh, Area 18, man, you gonna give me a parking spot or what? Nope. You're fucked, bro. You guys got any Tex-Mex places around you? They usually have some, like, breakfast taquitos and shit. Like, does by the dozens. Like, there's this place called Taco Cabana here where I live. In the morning only, man. Like, they stop selling that shit at, like, 10, 11 o'clock in the morning. You can get a dozen of, like, breakfast taquitos. Like, egg and sausage or bean and cheese. Ooh, and it's like a combo fuck? pack for, like... 11 bucks and they give you like salsa and shit it's a pretty good deal come on area 18 what the hell is your story the only thing is that the tortillas suck man tortillas they're all hard and shit yeah no er everything here is tex-mex we don't have real mexican food here even the mexican <laughs> fucking that own restaurants here don't even make mexican food they just make shitty you want American Mexican food, right? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Aren't tortillas supposed to be hard on a fucking taquito? No. <laughs> well, I mean, you can have your soft tacos and then your hard tacos. Right? Wait, no, a taquito is a rolled up, crunchy, like deep fried fucking taco. You're thinking of more like a chimichanga or... No, no, I'm um, not. No, I am not. I'm talking about taquitos, my guy. So normally, like, when, whenever, like, here, closer to, like, Mexico, right? If I ever order a taquito, it comes, like, a, a flour tortilla, kind of loosely wrapped like a burrito, but you're supposed to, like, unfold it and just eat it like a taco. I don't know. Like, but if you get, like, a burrito, like, it's, like, I don't know, like, fucking seven inches long, and it's got some girth to it, you know, and it's all wrapped up on I both up. ends. Fuck it. And, you know, it's like, and then a taco is, like, a taco shell. Where you have your soft tacos and your hard tacos. Yeah, dude. But Look, then you have right rolled here. tacos. A, a, a taquito, rolled taco, or flauta is a Mexican food dish that typically consists of small rolled up tortilla containing fillings. The tortilla is then crisp fried or deep fried. Yeah, it's supposed to be crunchy. And I just got interdicted? What the fuck? <laughs> you just got Double interdicted dicted? like 29,000 kilometers from Arcorp. There's not even a ship near me. 
What the fuck? Who's, du who's double dicking you, bro? What, what's going on? What does that mean? Interdicted. I got pulled out of uh, quantum. Oh, we got pulled out hard. <laughs> this is so good. It's like a tractor beam. So, okay, so like a flauta is like a, a tightly rolled taco with usually like um, shredded beef in the middle or sometimes we'll get chicken. Right, that's, I, that's no, I know how to make flautas. Yeah. yeah, that's deep yeah, fried. Yeah. Or you can, you can also pan fry flautas. And yes. then chimichanga is that's, pan fried. Yeah, 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 pan fried. Same thing, or deep fried chimichanga, right? It's more like, like a little yeah. fat, chunky burrito that's all wrapped up and then you can fry that bitch. Yeah, but taquitos like, are also supposed to have a crunchy, hard shell, taco yeah, shell. I've never had a taquito with a shell. It's always been a flour shell and like loosely wrapped. So you can like unwrap it. No, that's that's a fajita. Fajita is soft. A taquito is fucking hard. <laughs> God damn it! I'm, 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 I'm fucking arguing with you about this. No, bro. I have never heard no. of a soft taquito. Yeah. Unless it's been fucking the fucking sink forever. No, no, it's just it's a flour tortilla that's been warmed up, and that's all. It, like, you put it on one side for a couple of seconds, you flip it on the other side for a couple of seconds, and it's ready to go. They don't deep fry it or not. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, bro, like a breakfast taquito, bro. Like Whataburger has them too. Breakfast taquito. No, I know. I'm they're just not like full like, on burritos. No, they're not. I, I know what a fuck. It's supposed <laughs> to be crunchy and hard. <laughs> and then a fajita is just a flat freaking. They just give you the tortilla and you take your own meat and then make your own little taco. <laughs> It's like, you yeah, I don't know how he got the fajitas from. I know what you said earlier, and it wasn't yeah. fajita. No, no, no I'm talking no. about you, GT. Dude. Somehow you jumped the fajita. <laughs> like we're not even talking about fajitas. Yeah, because Cat was like, "There's fajitas." No, there's he didn't fajitas. say fajitas. You misheard him. I swear he did. No. <laughs> I swear he did. You want to say what you said again, Cat? No, I did say fajitas. You did say he did, fajitas? Bro. He did, he did. I yeah, I did, attention. I did. Hold on, hold on. I just Googled it. Are taquitos supposed to be crunchy? Bro, I will send you pictures of actual food, and I'll give you the names of the shit, bro. <laughs> according, according to Google, here, this is, this is, this is from allrecipes.com. If the taquitos are not crisp when cool, you haven't cooked them long enough. And my mind wants to go to like a chimichanga, bro, not a taquito. Okay, uh, I'm not. I'm not saying that there isn't fry, uh, like you know crispy um, taquitos, but in in my experience, they've always been just warmed up uh, flour tortillas. Because you also have corn. But a taquito but looks never... more like a rolled taco. Like yeah. <laughs> go to 7-Eleven. Go anywhere. And you order a taquito. It's a rolled taco with a filling in the middle. Yeah, and like then the things they sell fried. at 7-Eleven. Yeah. The fucking all subs. You guys know what all subs is? Yes, I've been doing all subs. Yeah. Yeah. The, the roll chicken. the roller taquitos they have. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's what I'm talking about. They do not have a soft shell. They're supposed to be no. crunchy. Yes. When yeah, they're soft yeah. like that, it means they've been sitting on the fucking roller for too long. And they're all limp and shit. <laughs> and see where where I go to get breakfast taquitos, this place called Taco Cabana. That's what they that that's what they they're not fried, bro. They're just oh god, what are you They're not fried, they're just in the flour tortilla like that. <coughs> And they have they already have uh, like a uh, well, uh, egg and chorizo cooked together. No, GT, it just sounds like your own damn people don't know what the hell they're cooking. <laughs> it's Tex-Mex, bro. I don't know. <laughs> I gave up. Yeah, fucking dude. Area 18 wouldn't give me a fucking landing place. I'm just coming into Artcorp to fucking get a different oh. ship. Would you want to fight Pisces this first? No, no, I'm in my cutty. That was a joke. We can we can do Pisces after this. Be surprised how badass a little Pisces can be. A couple of badgers on the front, yeah. 
It does have two missiles. <laughs> it has missiles? Uh-huh. Got two. <laughs> That's almost as good as my Gladius. Um, I want to say they're two size one missiles, but... All right, so apparently I don't have the server giving me ATC clearance. I had to request like six times earlier. Well, area 18, I tried like nine. <laughs> and every time it would just go right into cancel. The uh, bound button, like, don't even bother. I've been actually hitting like F1. And it's just been like, you know, it goes into the hailing and then just disappears and never gives me a spot. It's extremely busy. Well, this server is just ass. Yeah, this server is pretty shit. Yeah. It's like fucking six, seven ACS. Yeah. Uh -huh. anywhere that's what was happening to me at Everest bro I couldn't get a fucking landing spot to save my life and even though I went out and landed in a pad and went inside and set my imprint to Everest I still woke up at fucking Norville I'm gonna do. No, that's not. I don't care about that. for this fuck it plus 90 grand worth of fucking cargo in the back <laughs> let's see how well this works out oh you fuck apparently you can't bedlog in an armistice zone that's what you get. Huh? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I said that's what you get. I heard what you said. I just didn't <laughs> fully understand how I un like how I deserved what I got because the game sucks and won't give me a fucking place to fucking park in the space station. This is fucking funny, bro. I don't know. Assuming, assuming that you could fucking bed back. <laughs> like, ah, eh, fuck it, I'll just do it. And then, oh wait, I can't. God damn it. <laughs> well, if anything, it's even shittier because, like, I, I don't really want to bed log because that's pretty much like asking me to lose 90 grand that's in my cargo hold right now. You want me to bring my cutty over? We can transfer the cargo and then I can just send it to you. No, I don't really give a flying fuck. Like, if it gets lost, it gets lost. Hooray, star system. <laughs> Dude, that's like 100 grand. Yeah. That's a lot of money right now. Yeah. Could have made more, but, you know, whatever. I doubt it. This fucking sir, I'm waiting for the 30k to fucking smash any minute. 
fucking server's gonna 30k? Uh, I don't think so. But actually, it might. We're at 34,516 entities, and it's like stop there. Oh, there we go. Now it's moving again. Okay. Were you, were you guys at Everest? No, I'm at Arc L1. I'm out at Arc Corp, and uh, I'm at OM3. Why, you want to fight GT? Go ahead, dude. Let's do it. Warp to me, buddy. I just saw OM1. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Wait, you're out at Everest, right? I no 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 no. I just left atmosphere in Lorville. At Lorville, okay. Mm -hmm. right, I'm like right on. above Lorville. All right, let me come there. Let's see what happens. Frustration. Meet me at OM one. No, it's going to smash me right back into the same server again. We will see. Ah, got it. Oh, cute. Nice. I'm like two minutes out. Already there. Oh boy, bug. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, right next to it. I'm not gonna use any missiles because I'm in my uh I have two missiles. Yep. I'm in my cutty black and I don't wanna fuck it. It's it's already an unfair fight. <laughs> Alright. Got two bulldogs ready to go. You wanna send me an invite really quick here? To put me back in the same server, but I want to see if that allows me to do anything. Yeah, I need an invite too. I don't see you guys. Oh, I see it. Accepted. Ooh. A little smoother. Here's the thing, don't don't report me for murder when I kill you. Okay. Just make yeah, sure like you, last time. Make sure, yeah, just the minute you blow up, just start smashing the right bracket instead right of bracket. the left bracket. Okay. Like I said, cat, you'll still get a crime stat for blowing up his shit, but it'll be a tier two. So you can still go in a space station and pay it off. It doesn't keep I mean, we you. could take down the comma ray. Couldn't do that. I usually use a Pisces for doing that. Yeah, it's easier. Uh, there's a place on the comma ray that you can like. Hey, I can park. Um, that you can like slip it in, and the guns can't hit you. In the body of it, there's like these tanks, and you can um, basically like slip between the tanks with an arrow or a Pisces. Um, you can also use the, um, whatchamacallit, um, the 100i. I have to remember that next time I'm running around with Smash. We took the uh, Security Coast here in the other day. Took the what? Security Post Kira. 
at so a Korea Crusader. or Korea. Yeah. Yeah. And incomplete. Um, so that you can use a medium sized ship and you basically want to come at it from underneath and slip in and park right under the landing pads, like up against the body of the space station and the guns can't hit you there and like you're in a shadow. And so like, you're not visible unless someone like hits you with an, uh, you know, with a ping. We ended up having a group of like 40 people. So we had like 20 people without crime stats and like 10 people flying around the station, guarding it from anybody coming in to hunt the people in the station. Yeah, most of the stuff I do, I'm used to having to do it stolen. Like, I know people that play, but most of the time they don't play unless there's been an update because they don't see a reason to, you know. All right, GT, you ready for this? Yeah. I'm gonna do it. All right, you fire the first shots. What are you flying, GT? No, Aurora. Oh. <laughs> Can I actually take him? <laughs> Aurora is more capable than most people think it is. Not in so much default form. Uh, I don't remember. You got the MR, didn't you? Or that's what... That's the package. The ASOC, Pretty sure you're using an Aurora MR. Yeah, it's an MR. Yeah, it's not the fighter one. Uh, well, you, you took your. Oh, you took your. Uh, Colors you said, didn't you? I just soft at them. <laughs> He's fucking spiraling towards the planet. Oh, is that why I haven't died? What, what yeah, you're what? still alive inside. You're Technically, you can Y get out and you can eject, like you could like jump out the door and you'll like fall to your death slowly. No, no, no. Jump out the door and come uh, yeah. fly over to my ship. Oh, shit, Hold on. My now. shit's on fire in here. Oh, man, I'm flying around on the inside of the cabin. <laughs> Hold Y. Hold Y. Get out. Get out. Get out. No, he is. That's why he's, the ship is tumbling and it doesn't have gravity right now because all the, whatchamacallit, like oh, you'll like slowly to... bounce around on the inside. Oh, God, dude. I'm trying to get out the fucking door. <laughs> oh, God. Please visit us Almost there. <laughs> Almost out the door. Almost out the door. Don't I have like a jetpack or something? No. Yeah, you, you can go EV. <laughs> not while he's in atmosphere. He's not in atmosphere. No, I'm waiting. If he's falling to the planet, he's in atmosphere. No, no, no. His engines were still going and he was spiraling like no, off into space. He's stopped now. Almost out the door. Gotcha. All right, GT. I I'm gonna open my back door. Welcome. I think I actually the hell? Out of space. Yeah, Jesus. you should be able to maneuver your way to my ship. Welcome to the ASOC oh, vehicle retrieval system. Ah, yeah. Okay, we're good. Yeah, you see me over here? Yep, I see you. Pretty sure I had the rock in the back of my ship, but eh. I wish I had my old cutty. <laughs> Good shit. Guys on it. <laughs> Look at my ship. <laughs> Just hovering out there. Yeah, dude. Poor thing. Yeah. Hey, I got like 10 seconds. You can be my gunner against John. You want to finish off your ship? Good, man. 
Blow it up. Vehicle it's just gonna sit there the whole time, isn't it? Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Could be mine, Shanu. Persistence. Then I feel like switch right here. I need to flick. Yep, right there. I don't know why it would matter. Oh, damn, that's sensitive. You can turn down the sensitivity. If you look around, there should be one thing that says. Let me see. Oh yeah, decrease sensitivity. There you go. Oh, that's where you got it. Then there's like different things you can do to, so when cat turns, you don't turn and stuff like that. But I don't oh, remember lock what. It, right? Huh? You can lock it. Um, I think it's C that or something gyro, like that, yeah. or yeah, to, uh, C is to to center it. Oh, yeah. maybe it's G. I don't know. All right, I'm going to fly over to Everest and get repairs real quick. Oh, God, I got it on the left side. Ooh. <laughs> got to be careful about that, bro. <laughs> yeah, forget occasionally. Yeah, I'm going in for repairs real right. quick. I'll be there. I'm just leaving Arco one now. Hopefully. He scratched a couple of his fenders by shooting at him. Yeah, he did. He's, he, was, he scratched one of those uh, nose wings. Come at me, bro. I'll bite. Man, every time I come up to a space station, no matter what space station, I always approach it upside down for some reason. Uh, I've learned some tricks. I've been playing a lot recently, so. There's a few ways to tell. I was always trying to, like, look for the lights and signs and shit, you know, and that, I figured that, but that doesn't help me. <laughs> I always approach upside down. That's one way to do it. There's also like, we gotta go to a different pad. There's also like uh, a couple other uh, indicators that you can use to tell. Uh, this lag is killing me every time I go to quantum. I'm knocking myself back out of quantum. I hit it the first time, but like, God damn it, it didn't take. And right as I press it the second time, it goes into quantum and I cancel it. People who abandon ships on pads deserve a special place in hell. Hmm. I've only done this once. Will told me to do it. It was actually the last time I played this. 
Everybody just wouldn't give me a landing spot. And he's like, if I could just land it on a pad and come inside. And he could met me at the elevator because I couldn't get the fucking elevator open. But technically, this is the most fun. <laughs> that I abandoned wow. my ship on the pad. <laughs> yeah, but that time, like, the difference is it will eventually get impounded. When, when will you learn that your actions have consequences? Well, didn't you land without <laughs> permission too? No, I was requesting, but it wasn't giving me shit. I know, but that day, didn't you land and like you just like? Did you not have permission to land on the pad? Or no, the pad, you don't yeah. need permission. No, yeah, I just landed on that shit, got out. Oh, dude, we're gonna explode. And we exploded. Did they explode? Or? Nah, they exploded. It was a nice little nudge. It says your engine is destroyed. Eh, just my weapon systems and stuff. You're gonna die. No, we're good. We're good. We good. Why is it so shaky? Because <laughs> there's stuff underneath us. Uh, and what are you doing? I was trying to nudge the freelancer off the pad. Uh huh. And now there is a shell of a freelancer on the pad. <laughs> and you're all busted up. Yeah. Oh, a little bit, not a lot. Just we lost like one engine, some weapon systems. Nothing crazy. Five million out apparently. Oh, fucking Christ. I'm gonna have to get a, a, a pad. Or an interior pad. There's four pads at Everest. They all have something on it? No, but they're not working. So two of them didn't work for repairs. Uh, one of them had a bunch of shit on it. Two ships. And then the other one also didn't work. Uh... How close to the pad can you get, like, hovering above it, like, all the garbage on it? Pretty fucking close, but so, I'm just gonna land. You don't technically have to land? I've repaired no, I know, hovering, I like, just above the pad. Like, you gotta be pretty damn close, but... I can't get that close, but yes, I, I, I tried to get close enough. It wasn't. Well, that's the side. You didn't see nothing, GT. You, you yep. don't, you, don't you talk. Cool. Are you getting out? Are you no, get I'm not getting out. I'm just repairing and refueling and shit. Okay. And then we're going to go fight John. Okay. I will be at... Fun. Yet. What are you in, Patrick? I'm in the same thing he is. 
Hold on, I'm killing the cutty. Uh, where is that HP? There we are. Yeah, follow me. Wait, you want to fight an Atmo? Hell right. yeah! <laughs> We're going to Stanhope? Yeah. Just outside Stanhope. Then you can repair it, Stanhope. Oh, I'm fully repaired now. I'm ready. No, I'm just saying, like, in general. Like, afterward. I mean, one of us is going to be dead. Say when. Oh, we're going to make this fun. Uh, we won't lock on until you say when. Yeah, I'm just hitting the deck. <laughs> oh, we're going low, huh? <laughs> Fucking kind. Apparently, I can't lock on. Anytime. Anytime. Sorry, GT. I had to get a good shield facing him. No, you're good, man.
more shooting, GT. He got out. Yeah, he got out. Okay. <laughs> what is that, water? Wait, did you get out? Did you backspace? I could have picked you up. No, I died. Oh, I thought you got out. No. I said I didn't make it in time to inject. Oh, I don't even know what button to eject with anymore. I changed it. Oh, there's an ejector seat? Not in all ships. But that's still cool. Like all the fighters have eject. I don't think Cutlass has eject. The Cuddy Black? I don't think so. I just want to do it on purpose. <laughs> Probably have to clean your ship after that. God damn it, I was right there. Warning major torque imbalance. <laughs> oh, I, I used to see that. Is it because there's damage to the engine? Yeah, yeah, yeah we, uh, we took on some damage during that fight. Let's take a look at the damage. So we're missing some panels on our engines. Let's see what we got. Hey, following. Oh, yeah. yeah, we got a little fucked up there. You're not live anymore? No, I signed off to go get food and then I didn't go get food. Okay. Oh, dude, I didn't know you were streaming too. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm live over on Kick, where I was. The fuck is Kick? The uh, new streaming service. Oh, okay. I like it because the first night I had 10 viewers for like the whole stream, but now I nice. don't get more than John. That's fine. I had to hit you with a couple of those missiles. Uh, no, I dodged the missiles, but your ballistics were fucking me up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the hell you clipped me with, or did I smack into the ground? No, I hit you with uh, at least one missile, and uh, I took your shields down at one point. I was pretty much firing four missiles at you at a time. Yeah, no, they the, one of them came really fucking close. Like it zipped right over my cockpit. And normally I, I, I hit uh, my thrusters and go up when there's a missile about to hit me. But I decided to go down with that one because I felt like if I went up, it would have hit me. Yeah, that was... Dude, at one point it looked like you shot multiple missiles at us. Yeah, he was firing four. I was firing four at a time. <laughs> oh, shit. See, I didn't see that. It was just at one point where it looked like there was like four missiles coming at us at once. And then everything else was just like one missile at a time. No, I was shooting four missiles at a time. And then while they were reloading, I would switch over to guns and peep plaster him with my guns. <laughs> And the minute like, he would shoot missiles at me, I'd be like, okay, you want to go missiles again? <laughs> I'd go back to missiles and I'd shoot four missiles at him. <laughs> yeah, I still have good. like the fucking, even after repairing, my alarms are going off. If I didn't break away and go down to the ground, I would have probably destroyed you. Because <laughs> I gave you a chance to pretty much just follow me. You took out one of my engines when you were chasing me. Yeah, don't no, don't do, don't go easy on me. I've been I've been practicing with some of the best in the galaxy, man. 
may not be as good as them, but I'm getting pretty decent at it. Don't worry, you probably won't survive this round. I'm bringing my Vanguard to you. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you got plenty of time to repair. I'm all the way at fucking Mike L5 again because I forgot to reset my spawn at Everest. So I'm fully repaired. Uh, you come on back, and uh, I'm definitely going down, but do you I'm wanna, getting the gladius after do you, this. Do you want to take on a bounty while you wait for me? Because I'm just waiting for this thing to do its respawn, and then I still got 32 million kilometers Welcome to go after to that. Well, 30 million. Yeah, uh, all I've got left. is the, the, the group warrant. I can't do that one right now. It took, you got, takes like 45 Here, minutes. Oh, well, anything I pick up is going to be out this way. Yeah, don't worry about it. We're good. We could take, take him over to Lorville and run the racetrack. I'm spawning a ship now, but like I said, I've got about, what, a four-minute flight? I'm 30, yeah. 30 million kilometers out. I'll do some low flying with GT. So I was hoping wherever I came down was going to be like canyony. I was going to start doing a bunch of turns in canyons, but like I said, when I broke broke away from you and went to go down to the surface you like you ripped apart one of my fucking engines and so i braked around and turned and then at that point you took out my shield come on you can do it spawn you piece of junk oh it spawned it just didn't Let me go. Fuck it. I'll smoke then. There you go, GT. How's that for some views? That's cool, man. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Please visit us again. Your landing gear is still down. I don't uh, Yeah, I know. <laughs> Are you trying to fly upside down? No, nah, he just floated. Oh. Oh, it never repaired the sides, dude. It's still missing those fucking. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't always work. Those panels. Yeah. That's why you blow up your ship instead of storing it. So if he stores it and it comes back, like, say, tomorrow, are those panels still going to be like that? Yep. He'll pretty much what lock it in. Yeah, if you ever do bounties and stuff like that, and you like do serious damage to your ship and you notice that stuff isn't repaired properly, you don't store it. You blow it up. The minute you store it, it's going to lock whatever's busted in. So like how I always fly the Vanguard and stuff, it's got that big ass nose cannon on the front. Um. If I knock that off in some way and I don't pay attention and I store it and I like reclaim it or do anything, it'll never come back. I have to like manually reinstall one again, essentially. It's a known issue. And that's what concerns me though. It's like, they already have issues with components and failure and like disappearing. And now they want to make, give you the ability of detaching it and reattaching it. Whoa! What the? Well, that was interesting. Cool. All right. All right. Well, I'm gonna be a little bit longer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Did you hit Shit. hit an invisible wall. Uh, apparently, yes. <laughs> apparently, I came out of the space station and. Um, yeah, no. Oh, it, yeah. it did not go well. <laughs> I just saw it on your stream. Damn, dude. We're going to go to the sun side and do some low flying. GT. Let's go, man.
Yeah, you must have taken out one of my power cells or something because my low power warning is fucking going crazy still even after repairing. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. God damn it. Urgh, I have to pay for it again? Should I go after him with an arrow? I can bring a buccaneer. I can go grab my buck. My name's Buck and I come to fuck. That's, well, that's alarming. Is that oh. way. Hey, three minutes to kill again. And you know, they they really need to get the arcade games working in the Galleria. So that you can just fucking sit and wait and play arcade games, huh? Well, I got three minutes to kill. Like, get, 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 you know, like, give me Miss Pac-Man or some shit. Donkey Kong fucking rip off something, like. sit here and people watch you know what I'd really like is to be able to click on the fucking warnings and shut off the alarm yes I know power was low thank you did you go to Stanhope to repair or did you come back yeah. to Everett? no I went to Stanhope Yo, I got a, I got a weird question. So, say that cat is hauling ass close to like the surface of the planet, right? And I, and I jump out of his ship. Will that kill me? Yeah. I want to do it. Yeah, the game has yeah. physics. It, I, I mean, it. here's the thing: you probably shouldn't even get out of your seat while I'm low <laughs> here's flying. The thing. This fucking cat, bro. Because, because. I do some shit, man. It's okay, man. Hey, look, I installed the mod. It's got me like a Spider-Man thing, dude. I can stick to walls. It's okay. Why is there debris in there? Oh, that sure. Cool. <laughs> I've never seen this stuff before, dude. This is cool. Sorry, everybody. Don't mean to make you sit here, tear at the ground for another three minutes. How far away? This thing feels sluggish compared to the Gladius, man. Where do I have to go? Oh, I already closed the page. It's her elf. Five of it's got like a top speed of 275 in the atmosphere. How's that low? <laughs> you almost, <laughs> you almost bottomed out right there. Real almost, high. but I didn't. system. I actually want to see something now. Your insurance claim has been sent. Thank you. Please visit us again. Right. I'm going to take my cutlass again. 
but I'm gonna make a quick stop at her L5. There's a Mustang Delta and a Cuddy over here by us. I'm gonna go check it out. Trespassing on private property, bro. Trespassing. Yep, yep, yep. I'm leaving. I'm, yeah, I'm not with this guy. I'm gonna jump out the ship. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> Did you really jump out? I'm fixing to. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Yeah, we are on a fucking extra gravity planet. You'll be fucked. <laughs> I haven't given you the opportunity. Have you done a ground drop? Guess what with I just a... did. <laughs> <laughs> Take a ground vehicle and you can take you can uh, drop from out of atmosphere and fall all the way through atmosphere and uh, survive it in a car and just drive away. Yeah, he literally slammed into the ground. Nothing happened. Who you did? Yeah, dude. Just jumping out of a plane? Mm hmm. Well, I jumped out of uh, a cat's. Yeah. Oh, Interesting. He should have impacted the ground and died if he was going full speed. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. It wasn't in like show my body bouncing everywhere or nothing. It just went like a lawn dart, just stuck right into oh, the yeah. ground. Oh yeah, totally. yeah. <laughs> no, you I thought like it was gonna be like a, over now. like a rag doll or something. Yeah, no, no, no. nothing like that. No. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Visit again. Especially if there's rocks. Like yeah, you just get caught that's up in the rocks. That was disappointing. Yeah. No, there's like debris and shit that Cat was flying around. Now the question is, is, is Cat upset that I left this side door open? He can close it. Yeah, he can <laughs> close it. <laughs> nah, I, I jumped out, man, because I think I'm going to have to get off here in a minute. I guess, is this Everest? I'm at Everest. I respawned at Everest, dude. I didn't wake up at Norville. Well, that's where you set your shit, isn't it? No, no, because last time I played with you, remember? I, I got off from the pad and I came all the way in and I couldn't store my ship. Right now, when I woke up today, I woke up on the planet in Norville, not at Everest. Mm. Fucking game, dude. <laughs> make sure my imprint's here. You are here to launch. Do that shit all again. What are you, uh, what are you guys gonna be up to tomorrow? Whole I don't know why my ship's known. getting destroyed right now by a fucking security site that I didn't know was here. <laughs> you still uh, trespassing, dude? Yeah. That's I couldn't get out I before they fucked up my ship, so... I thought that was funny. I was like, oh god, we're trespassing. I gotta bail. <laughs> and there goes my ship. Oh god. Cool. Oh, well, I'm waiting for you to respawn your ship. I am going to go and stop at her L5. something i think i'm gonna hop off too i gotta work in the morning still all right then every day this week and, well this weekend today and tomorrow all right i'll catch you gents later all right right on man that's good gaming dude have a good one He got mad. <laughs> huh? 
because I, I jumped out the door. <laughs> he told me, don't get out of your seat. <laughs> I fucking got off, bro. I don't think that was it. <laughs> no, but that shit was funny, though. I honestly was expecting to see, like, you know, like a GTA ragdoll or something happened. Nope. And, like, no, he jumped out. Sometimes the guy it was just, like, yeah. It, was, it, it made me incapacitated. So I was kind of like, you know, passed out. But you could still see me falling. And it was like I was looking down at my chest the whole time, but you could still see that I was like spinning and that was fun. And then like a lawn dart, dude. Boom! And that was it. Ran into the ground. That was the end of it. It was great. <laughs> it probably would have looked a little different if I had pushed F4, right? And I was like looking third person. Probably. See, so yeah, I gotta do it again now. I can see what it looks like. <laughs> I mean, you should be ragdolling, but if, like again, if there was uh, like rocks or debris, like you just got caught up on that and stopped dead. You know, quite honestly, what it looked like, dude, is it, it looked like um, debris from like a, a fallen satellite or like a space station or something. That shit was like all over the ground. Dude. Well, that's the whole planet. It's like covered in debris and trash. Yeah, that's what that's what it was. Yeah. And like, I guess I smashed into some debris, man, and that was just the end of it. <laughs> then I woke up in the medical bed. <laughs> nice. Yeah. But see, like I said, now I have to do it again because we have to push F4 to see the ragdoll effect, bro. <laughs> it's a must. All right, man. Well, I guess I'll catch you tomorrow, bro. You gonna be gaming? Doing something? Yeah, I'll be doing something tomorrow. I have no idea what. I don't know why at what time. I always say I want to get on early on Saturday or Sunday and I never do. See, and you make me feeling bad, bro, because I always hear you say, yeah, I'm going to game in the morning and I'm like, fuck, I don't wake up till like 11, 12, you know, and I was like, this guy's already ready for a nap. Pretty much. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm usually still gaming in the morning, but like I just like for whatever reason have like no desire to stream in the morning, even though I want to, I just still never do. And yeah, like, morning streams are a lot harder, dude. I've been still meaning to go and get my car registered and insured and you said you oil changed. Do it. Oh, I know. No, no fuck no. Uh, no, nope. it don't feel bad because the wife's car needs to get registered too. And I've got a couple goes. more days till the end of the month. I think you get a week after it expires. Yeah, I'm not willing to deal with that. Like a week or like yeah, like something like that. But. It's yeah, easy just, get, just easy just easy to get taken care of. In, in the case of the wife's car, man, I think it's just it needs the uh, cause I, we already fixed the windshield. That was what was holding up the inspection. So we need to go get the inspection done again, and then just go get the, the registration taken care of. Fucking kicked up a rock on the highway, boom! Because it already had a crack, you know, it was kind of like low, but I guess that that rock hit it in us and just the right spot, dude. And it fucking it, it, yeah, it cracked all the way up. The the middle of the oh, game. sorry about that, everybody. The windshield, so the dude was like, yeah, I can't pass it like that. And they got Utah got rid of that shit. <laughs> we paid for the windshield to get done, and we just didn't have to get expected to get the registration and stuff, so we still need to do that. And then everything with my truck, so. Yeah. Well, right on, man. I, I appreciate you guys inviting me in. Sorry, I couldn't hang on. Yeah, you know you're always welcome. Yeah, yeah, bro. I appreciate it. Like, I feel like I just drop into your game whenever the fuck I want. Yeah. <laughs> well, the same, dude. You guys are always welcome. Man. Good, I know. Good, good people. Good company. <laughs> I don't know who you're looking at. Dude, shut up, bro. You're looking <laughs> tight. Dude. All right, man. I'll catch you later, bro. All right, man. I'll talk to you. All right, man. Later. later. All Well, I guess it's down to me. Um, we haven't been on very long. We've only been on for like two hours. Uh, I'd like to go pick up my reclaimer, or I mean my uh, vulture, and go back over to that spot, but that is now lost. I'm going to be able to, uh, whatchamacallit, go back and forth to the... Uh, freelancer. I'm gonna fill that thing with salvage. That will be a pretty penny. Good game, man.
You and Cat both kicked my butt. I wish he was still streaming. I could have seen it from his end. chances sweet thing happens when I go and get my vulture back out do you think it'll have a full load of cargo I doubt it will Oh, come on. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Storing that. I did leave it there, didn't I? Well, that changes things. That can come back here. I don't want that over there. Your insurance claim has been set. That can come back here. Insurance claim has been sent.
They can stay all where they are. Please visit us again. Hmm. Goodbye. Well. <laughs> What are we gonna take? Uh, uh. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. I think I do a bunch of hopping just to get my vulture back. God damn it. Let's do this. Let's take this when it spawns in four seconds. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Hangar three. We need a utility. That already have one in it. It doesn't look like it. Yeah, it does. All right. Where are we? Hangar three. So we can use the Pisces to use the med bed and fly back to Arc L1. Grab the vulture. So we can keep doing what we were doing. Is that like a plan? Two missiles. Uh, where are we going? I got one. Thank you. And please visit again. That's going to be micro attack. On the other side. <laughs> uh, sure. Any particular reason why you don't want to allow me to quantum any place? Uh, this game. Literally will not trigger to go in the quantum. Am I missing something here? I mean, can't imagine what I would have done. It is spawn without a quantum drive. <laughs> uh, uh, you know what? Before we get too far away, I'm gonna do this. It's Friday night, and I'm going to go with the servers are busy as shit and are laggy as fuck. And yeah, it is a nightmare right now trying to get anything done. Because that quantum won't even work. Won't even trigger. So, um, uh, probably just gonna call it a night and go get the rest of my food and. I will see you maybe in the morning and most likely in the afternoon. And we'll figure something out then. And 
play some more, make some more money, earn some more rep, and again, wait for the next wipe. Hopefully, it will be a soft wipe, and uh, Wake there State will keep our rep, and we'll keep our money, and uh, we'll just lose a little bit of our uh, bought items. But other than that, everybody have a good night, and uh, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for the likes, and again, if you like what you're seeing, feel free to subscribe and click the bell, so then that way you get a notification for when I do go live. Have a good one, everybody.